Hey guys, Jeff here. Today I will show you how to increase your performance in Battlefield Hardline by using the NVIDIA control panel settings and by creating a custom config file. I will also explain some of the most important in-game gameplay and graphical settings. On your desktop, right click and choose NVIDIA control panel. Go to Manage 3D Settings, Program Settings and add your Battlefield Hardline application. You can also check out the description below for a more detailed explanation about this Battlefield Hardline tweak guide. Change the following settings. Set your maximum pre-rendered frames to 1. Your multi-display mix GPU acceleration to single display performance mode. Set your power management mode to prefer maximum performance. The texture filtering negative LOD bias to clamp threaded optimization on and your vertical sync off. To create the custom config file, go to your Battlefield Hardline folder, check the description for the default location, open notepad and copy and paste the settings from the description. You can put your refresh rate of your monitor here or just delete it so you can have as many frames as your hardware can handle. The perf overlay draw VPS will show your FPS in your top right corner, so you're sure these commands will work with Battlefield Hardline. Go to File, Save As, and make sure the Save As type is set to All Files and not as a text document. Save the file as user.cfg in your Battlefield Hardline folder. Let's go in-game and check out what some of the most important gameplay and graphics settings are. First up is to make sure your raw mouse input is enabled. This way you have no mouse acceleration on top of your mouse input. Next thing you want to do is set your network smoothing factor all the way down to 0% for reduced latency and a better experience. Next thing you want to do is go to your in-game video options and set your mesh quality to ultra so you don't have any objects or texture pop-ins. Also turn off your anti-aliasing, anti-aliasing post and your ambient occlusion which is the most expensive performance hit. Also turn off your v-sync and your motion blur all the way to the left so it stays at 0%. My field of view is set to 90 but some people tend to go with a higher field of view, but there is a risk of motion sickness. Just copy the rest of my graphic settings if you want. I hope this Battlefield Hardline tweak guide helps you out. Now go play the beta and let me know in the comments below if you need any help. Grenade out. Boom. <laughs> echo, echo. Oh, this guy is up. Oh! Jeff, there's one there. Oh! You smacked him? Yeah, with the baseball bat. <laughs>